Welcome to Nightlife in Thailand, your ultimate guide to the vibrant and exciting nightlife scene in Bangkok. In this video, we will be giving you an introduction of Nana Plaza that has been an icon of Bangkok nightlife for decades and is probably unlike anything you've seen before. With three floors of more than 30 bars and hundreds of Thai girls and ladyboys, the mall turned adult entertainment complex now has the highest concentration of go-go bars in Thailand. The U-shaped building in the plaza is roughly square-shaped, with a single opening on the west side, and consists of a ground floor and two additional floors arranged around a courtyard. In the late 1970s, it began as a restaurant and shopping center. A few go-go bars appeared in the early 1980s, gradually replacing the shops and restaurants. By the mid-1980s, approximately 20 go-go bars had opened in the three-level court, capitalizing on the growth of tourist hotels in the area. Three short-time hotels, one of which has been renovated, operate on the top floor. Short-time hotels rent out rooms by the hour or more to patrons to take a bar girl for some fun. Most bar girls in Nana Plaza will leave with customers upon payment of a bar fine. The building closes at 3 a.m. and lies dormant until the following evening. As soon as you arrive in front of the complex, a huge neon sign is glowing with the words, Nana Plaza, and below it reads, the world's largest adult playground. Whether or not it's truly the largest adult playground, Nana Plaza is a must-see. That's because it has something for everyone, regardless of your personal preferences. Here's a short guide and some pointers for your first visit to Nana Entertainment Plaza. We are here to assist you if you don't know where to go or what to expect. Feel free to ask us questions in the comments section below at the end of the video and we will answer them to the best of our ability. Adult entertainment and shows are the focus of Nana Plaza. There are many bars with attractive Thai girls and lady boys. Each location has a unique mix of girls, music, and erotic shows. But with the largest selection of lady bars and go-go bars in Bangkok, Nana Plaza truly has something for everyone. You can start the night by sitting outside and drinking a beer at one of the ground floor beer bars, watching the events unfold. Alternatively, you can go to a go-go bar and drink inside with a girl while watching erotic shows and dances on stage. You'll feel like a celebrity as soon as you walk into any of these go-go bars. Take a seat, invite a girl to join you, and order a lady drink for her. After being asked what your name is, where you are from, and how many days you will be in Thailand, you can opt to pay a bar fine to take out the girl. You can also get curious and explore why Thai ladyboys are so famous by visiting one of the many ladyboy bars available. With all of these bars, girls, and shows, what happens in Nana Plaza is entirely up to you, and how inquisitive you are. In our previous videos, we have gotten many questions from our viewers who have a preference for ladyboys, asking where is the best place for them to visit, well, Nana Plaza and its surroundings is your answer. As mentioned previously, the majority of Bangkok's freelance ladyboy escorts can be found in the area surrounding Nana Plaza. Most are on the sidewalks around Nana Plaza and Soy 4, while others are in Sucumbit, near the entrance to the famous Soy Nana. Many of them can be quite touchy when you walk past them, so don't be afraid to reject them politely if you're not interested. Nana Plaza offers an excellent value for money, whether for drinks or companionship. Here are the current alcohol and lady prices at the majority of the bars. Import beer costs between 150 and 180 Thai baht, while hard liquor costs between 250 and 300 Thai baht. The lady drinks typically cost between 200 and 250 Thai baht, depending on the bar. Lady drinks are usually more expensive at go-go -go bars, so expect to pay around 250 Thai baht per lady drink. Typical bar fines range from 1,000 to 1,500 Thai baht. For those of you who do not know what a bar fine is, the bar fine lets the girl leave her job early and can range from 1,000 to 1,500 Thai baht depending on the bar and the duration that the girl would be away from the bar. If she somehow ends up at your place, she may ask for money for a taxi home, which could cost another 300 to 600 Thai baht. Of course, many bars on the ground floor have happy hour specials before 8 p.m., so get there early to take advantage of all these deals. 
Sukhumvit Soy 4 is located just outside of Nana Plaza and is the second most popular tourist destination in Bangkok after Khao San Road. But that doesn't make it any less interesting to visit. There are a few excellent bars and restaurants nearby as well. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more great content on the best nightlife destinations in Thailand. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.